Hey guys, what you're looking at here is a pine devil moth. Okay, this is a very interesting creature. It's one of the largest moths in the state of Virginia. Um, it's an adult now, it's fully formed. It's been through the egg, larva, pupa stage. Now that it's a moth, guess, or yeah, an adult moth, guess what? It's going to die very soon. How's it gonna die? Sadly, it's gonna to starve to death. This type of moth cannot eat. Basically, when they go from, when they're in the pupa, transforming from larva to moths, their mouths actually uh, get eliminated. So, once the, the pupa hatches, becomes a moth, and they do all this underground, by the way, um, this male, his only goal in existence right now is to reproduce so he will find a female and reproduce with that female okay in the mornings when he comes up out of the ground in the mornings you know what he's dying on the tree tonight the sun's going down hopefully this guy reproduced today now the female with whom he reproduced if he did indeed reproduce will lay her eggs tonight she will lay her fertilized eggs on the very night that she reproduced uh, just like a chicken and her eggs will hatch in seven to ten days and the whole process will start over again uh, the eggs will be laid underground the larvae will come out the pupa will turn into a moth all underground and then it will come out above ground for about one day during which time it will breed and then starve to death and die that night that is just really crazy. A lot of people say, oh, it's just a moth, or oh, it's just a bug, it's just an insect. But guys, the life cycle of some of these little critters are just amazing. And they're absolutely beautiful. The Pine Devil Moth of Virginia.